That's done it's with called heroin, heroin and not eating. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I don't care. Cool. Were things that were wrong with him? Yeah. Not sensitive. No, I would like, like that. I uh, <laughs> except for Kyle. Kyle's perfect. Yeah, Kyle's perfect. Yeah, yeah we're we're a crown yeah, over yeah. his head. Yeah. What, what? What? What's? What's? What? 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 What is? Ladies and gentlemen, the Gossip Boys back with Topic Thunder. Dean Sidoris, Captain Aquilo's the one and only. Jim McD, 3SB.co, and Kai. Kevlar <laughs> Kai. The best. Kevlar, Kevlar Kylie. The S. Someone else calls you Kylie, though. Yeah. Like a in bunch our crew. Of yeah, no, like in our crew, someone was saying on the mic. Uh, gaming crew, you know. Can't stand it. Invite only. <laughs> Invite only. <laughs> Nastiest fingers, not for ladies, the but for fingies. FPS. Nastiest yeah. fingers. Kai fingies. It doesn't, uh, it doesn't carry over. Yeah, I'm sorry, ladies. No, no, no. Non transferable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, non transferable <laughs> skills. We're loaded with those. Uh, highly. Sp- uh, a broad topic that we're going to narrow down. Okay. All right. Talking COVID. You can talk politics. You can talk favorite sports team or best player oh, wow. of all time. Wow, this is really broad. If you're talking Michael Jordan versus LeBron James, mm. all these arguments of debate, I think, in my personal opinion, debate has turned into something for pure entertainment. We never get to a point, we never get to agreements. I watch a lot of debates and a lot of different things, even in the fitness space. If you're talking nutrition debates, et cetera, et cetera. Can you shame someone into getting healthy or jacked? Fat shaming is a large topic, but we can dial it down. My personal opinion is uh, I've never, even I have so much inside shame, and I still can't stick to my diet. So why mm. would someone external shame into me change how I eat? Not because I think, oh, it's so mean, boo-hoo, you called a famous celebrity that's worth $100 million fat. I don't really care. Uh, but I just don't think it's a means to an end. You're not going to help them, and you're not going to help someone else watching. If I fat shame, we were just making fun of DiCaprio's dad bod or something. If you make fun yeah. of DiCaprio's dad bod, I'm not going to shame. That's not going to help some other dude's dad bod get fit. No. So are you are you asking us uh, directly? Yeah. 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 You, what do you think do about you, fat shame? Has think- it gone too far? Okay. It does it work? Does it work? Why, what's going on with it? What 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 what's what's what 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 is the point? Why do people think they're helping with it? And then why does the other side think that no, you're just being a bully? It's not going to work. Maybe. I think I think ninety percent of those people that are out there fat shaming or body shaming people have some big issues with themselves, and they're just lashing out. Like they don't like what they see in the mirror, or they're just like having a bad day. Yeah. Or they're just uh, an asshole. Yeah, I went on a huge rant uh, about like a, a discipline rant because that's the same thing too. People would like shame, like, why are they fat? Well, fat people just don't have discipline. Yeah. Like, oh, is that easy? And you're yeah, yeah. so fucking disciplined. Yeah, yeah. Just because you have a six pack and you love the gym means you're disciplined now. Yeah. Like, dude, you could be the biggest asshole. You could be addicted to drugs. You could be addicted to steroids. You could beat your kids for all we know, but you're disciplined because you have but a six pack. But you can pack. curl. You can yeah. do some curls in you the love, gym. You're killing it. Discipline has nothing to do with what you yeah. love to do. Without I'm be- disciplined to playing video games? Without, Fuck you. Without yeah. being incredibly, like, like not sensitive. No, I would like, like that. I, uh... <laughs> no, be insensitive. Yeah, let a, let a rip. Oh, I'm just like, dude, look at some fucking homeless people. Dude. I've, like, literally seen some homeless, like, in, in sack. I see some sure. homeless guys. Damn, Dean, that's too far. And I'm like, <laughs> well, I mean, just like. No jack, and they're like, and they're jacked. Yeah, we're not talking look, skinny, and they look sick. Yeah, and I'm like, oh, yeah. that's like an ideal body type right. for yeah, like yeah, a yeah. lot of men. There's yeah. like genetics, yeah. and that's it's done with heroin, heroin and not eating. Yeah, yeah. yeah. drugs or, or maybe discipline. But again, like, is discipline something that you love? Can you be? I'm disciplined no. in eating ice cream because I eat ice cream every day. That doesn't line up. But by the definition, discipline it is. Yeah. So all these people discipline shame. Fat shame, like what? What is your goal? I think you're right. I think it's an ego thing inside your fighting. Yeah, I think it's or a clout thing. Projection. At this point, it's a fucking clout thing. Yeah, Th- that I, too. But I think a lot of it is projection. Like I can just tell you that back in the day, we had a, a, a member of that old gym that we belonged to, who all of his gripes about other people were things that were wrong with him. Yeah, sure. And he yeah, was yeah. like adamant and screaming about it. And it's like, dude, that's you. Because he's like, one step away from self-awareness. Yeah. Like yeah, his yeah. subconscious knows what's fucked up in him and so he lashes. And, yeah, yeah. and I feel like that's driven out of shame anyway. You know, and you're trying yeah, to deflect that off to, to somebody else. It's like, oh, well, somebody else is worse than I am about yeah. this and so whatever. And the thing about shame... And we all do that in our own For life. Sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Small no, extent. I'm a fucking hater, yeah. I, I'm not. But, but I'm self-aware. I'm perfect. <laughs> Except for Kyle. Kyle's perfect. Kyle's perfect. Yeah, we're putting a crown yeah, over yeah. his head. It's going to float and Never glow and shake. Golden star, Kyle. Yeah. No. But I think uh, I think there's a spectrum, though, to it all. Just like how you started with politics or whatever. Kids all that. these days in their spectrums, dude. <laughs> Can't ever be black and white with these kids. 
Because like you, you can have the yeah, he's like, he you doesn't can... want to make enemies on this show. <laughs> you you can have like the super douchebag talking shit like, oh my god, why are you doing this? You're overweight, blah blah. blah. But then you can have the complete other way where they throw these chicks that are literally like 400 or the guys that are 400, 500 right. pounds on Vogue saying, no, you are beautiful. Then there's like people like, no, this person oh, is very yeah. unhealthy. And then it's like, no, why are you saying that? Why are you saying she's right. unhealthy? Well, it's like, well, no, they're like we're ch- they're trying to like look out for them at the same time, but they also don't want to get. The, the feet, the the lash back. One hundred percent. You yeah, can't yeah. judge intent of those people, and that's where I come down to is like, yeah. what is your intent of making that video or sending that tweet? Um, because some yeah. of that does come down to straight individual. Because you can be three hundred pounds, like especially yeah. ladies, you can be three hundred pounds and be healthy. If you go to your doctor, I don't think so. No, you can. You can for sure. Ladies are way like big thing with weight uh, is obviously diabetes and heart, uh, and and you can have a healthy ish lifestyle, be there and live forever. We know that. Like you know, fat people have lived forever, yeah, right? I think that, but I think not the, really. The percent- no, they're really fat. Really? I, feel I like do. If you I do. Play no, the no percentage chance. game, though. Right. So that's what I'm talking about. Intent. You can have an individual. I said. Okay. That goes to yeah, the yeah. doctor and works out and eats healthy and be 300 pounds. And, okay. But who's making the broad video saying, yeah, 300 or the Vogue thing saying yeah, yeah. 300 pounds is healthy? I'm not saying 300 pounds is healthy, but you can be healthy. Yeah. At 300 pounds. Yes. You and, with me? I, yeah. I, I get you. I get you. I, I think. There's a big problem with uh, with messaging with like these like uh, PC type of uh, for sure posts of yeah, like yeah. body uh, happiness or whatever what's it called yeah body acceptance. positivity yeah or acceptance but it's like okay yeah, yeah. there's nothing wrong and it should be celebrated to be happy with being comfortable in your own skin but let's not confuse that with promoting this as a how you should just like strive to be this way right. or not even strive to be this way but like accepting that this is like should be a norm for people right it's mm-hmm. like because most people should not be that way most people should be getting healthier and and making the steps to lose weight eat better for longevity and it just kind of gets it gets messy when these big corporations these big companies are using it a for clicks well and, why are they doing media it? because of more than half attention. of them more than half of america is fat and yeah. so if they want to get the dollars of the fat folks they're going to show people yeah. that are fat folks and like it's also it makes it makes 100% virtue sense. signaling right. and uh, all that stuff. But. but devil's advocate to that or the spectrum is that then they take Beyonce who let I'm making this up. Let's say she's 5'8 a buck 50 mm-hmm. and, and then they show her on the beach with an ounce of cellulite or or her hamstring isn't popping yeah. and they're like Beyonce's it's, it's fat. Up. It's so messed up. And you're up, like dude. okay, yeah. well like that's not helping either. Yeah, yeah, like it's all that's backwards. that's a normal woman, yeah, yeah. very attractive, yeah. very successful. This, the same writer for that panel right. po- no, for sure. puts the 400 pound person and says this person's beautiful. They're both uh, just people as, magazine. Just as beautiful as Beyonce. It's like, let's get real. She's not. Right. I'm sorry. Right. Or, or, she's not. Or, or she's on vacation and she's not shooting a, a record or a movie and so she gained 10 pounds. Yeah. Like, yeah. well, that's much different than the 400 pound example we're talking yeah. about here. Yeah. Like, for one celebrity not to look perfect. Yeah. And it's... Uh, and because people someone, love to tear people down. That's the, that's yeah. the thing. That's yeah. the thing. And like, yeah, in, sure. A, in Australia, they call it... Oh, my God. What do they call it? Poppy something... I love Australian slang, by the way. Yeah, it's, I, I can't remember. But it basically, it's like if you're tall poppy. That's what it's called. So if somebody like has reached some kind of higher level than everybody else, yeah. then it's a sport to tear them down. And uh, I think that that's, yeah. okay. that's roughly the same sure. kind of idea. That's the cancel culture, pretty much. Yeah, or, or jealousy yeah, so, tied yeah, up like because yeah. Beyonce's got more money than me. But like, it's all fun. I just don't get yeah. any of that. I get it within the clout game because everyone's like a nobody. Everyone thinks they're somebody, and so they're hating on everyone. Mm-hmm. But like a real celebrity, like Beyonce's got real talent. Yeah. You're like, no, why no, am I going to hate on her? Yeah, like, yeah, she yeah. can actually sing her yeah. tits off. Like, why am I... <laughs> she's not Millie Vanilli. Yeah, she's yeah. not Silent Mike. Like, yeah. she's got some real fucking shit going on. Like, yeah. why am I going to rip her ass and, down? And, and to quote someone, I won't mention their name because they're kind of controversial, but I watched a video from them. They're hilarious. But, uh... uh <laughs> they're really they're not, rude. They're Everyone hates them, but I love them. Kind of, exactly, yeah. He would say, like... Don't ask society like if you're healthy. He's like, go to your doctor, ask right. him. He will be. They're robots. Yeah. A doctor will be like, uh, yeah, appearing to this chart of your panels. Hell no. Yeah. Like, no, yeah. you're not healthy. Yeah, he's pseudo, not gonna lie to you. It's pseudo at least based on. Yeah, science. yeah. He, I like that. I like that. Yeah. That's that's. I agree. Yeah, yeah. I like that. yeah. He's I, like, he's like, don't ask me. I don't know shit. Ask your doctor. Go up to him. He's got their own opinion. And he goes, yeah. and he goes, yeah. ask him. He goes, well, I think you're a lovely lady, but no, you're not healthy. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was getting at with Michael. I was like, it's all about you know, it's all about the. 
the percentages, the numbers. Right. right. It's always about the numbers. Right. Okay, like look, your blood clo- uh, glucose. Your, you know, your, but a doctor will do that, your right? BMI. Yeah. You don't know that until you're with the doctor. Because yeah. BMI, I'm fucking gonna have a heart attack tomorrow. But they they check my blood, they check my heart, they check my pulse, they check all these things. They're like, yeah, yeah. yeah you're a little heavy, but probably because you work out, you'll probably be okay. Okay, yeah, thanks, yeah. doc. Right. Is or it, yeah. If yeah, they take yeah, someone yeah. else and your blood pressure's through the roof and your 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 fatty acids yeah. are all fucked, then they're like, ah, all right, you should probably it, lose some. Yeah. And isn't BMI our measurement of obesity? In yeah, it's still what we have. Yeah, it's still what we have. Archaic, it's like, damn, yeah. Mike. It's, but 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 if you don't work out, general broad swipe, mm-hmm. it is pretty good. No, yeah. that's, that's and that's fair. why we kept yeah. it, and that's what it's for. Yeah, right. and that's what we right. kept. I was right. thinking with an arm. meatheads were my, all fat. My mind always goes into like the niche yeah. world that we live in, where it's like, yeah. I then mean, we would have to see how often is it wrong versus right kind of thing. Like, right. And, and and again, by numbers, you know? it's probably pretty good. Well, mm. actually, I just listened to a whole potty, podcast. I love to say, well, actually. Uh, mm-hmm. Well, actually, I just listened to a whole podcast about BMI. Mm. And uh, BMI is is largely bullshit. Yeah. But in but actually, according to the person you listen to, no, 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 no. The studies, studies have been because it was the, the way it was constructed. Yeah, it was it was bullshit. Yeah, and they sort of knew they're like, okay, this isn't very good, but we don't have anything else. Because I've heard, I've and heard, that's I've and, heard very counter to that from people it's we the know. Kellogg's food pyramid. Yeah, I don't listen to any of those people. Anyway, the uh, the the issue is that it was the best thing that we had. At the time, yeah, well, and it probably we'll, still is. I think because how many people are going to be able to get a DEXA scan? Yeah. Well, that's yeah, the thing. Sure. That's, Not that many. It, yeah, it, so it can overestimate how how heavy people are, and it, it can draw a lot of conclusions about Errors in the right, right direction. I don't think anyone's saying yeah. it's perfect. Yeah, Where, yeah, yeah. Whereas, if whereas studies say somebody's 10, 15, 20 percent over their ideal weight, yeah. It's not that big a deal. They might actually be healthier. Yeah, ten mm-hmm. percent. Yeah, yeah. Sure. But somebody who's super heavy. And the thought that they're gonna be be healthy and stay healthy for a period for a long period of time that's probably still in question. Yeah, genetics. So there's a lot of genetics associated life, with life that, so. but yeah, for sure. Hey.